So I'm here with my Warmoth Strat, really just uh, loving and appreciating these Lindy Fraylin pickups that I that are in this thing. I've talked uh, about these on this channel before, but I really love this setup. I was watching um, uh, a buddy of mine from Berkeley, Berkeley, uh, <laughs> J. Leonard J. Um, we used to play in Beetle Ensemble together, and he was... Uh, he actually just uploaded his video about his favorite Strat mods, and um, what struck me as really funny was, hey, I'm using the same Strat mod as his for, like, the second mod, um, which is basically the uh, the third tone pot here is a blend knob. So so basically, like, it's a Strat, but you can get kind of like the telly sound, like where you get, like, bridge and uh, neck pickup together, which is basically like third position of a Telecaster by just rolling this all the way back. So if I'm in the neck pickup uh, position, it just blends in the bridge. So like I'm down to zero. Now that's full on kind of Telecaster mode. Turn off the echo. And I actually have even a little bit more control over it. Like I really like doing the neck pickup and then like maybe half blended with, uh, with some of that bridge in there. I've always been kind of a neck pickup guy, but like it's really cool to just brighten it up with a little bit of that. This is maybe just the neck pickup itself. Right, there's like neck pickup, and then here's bridge pickup maybe half blended in. It's really subtle but gives it a little bit more brightness, a little more sweetness, and then here's like all the way rolled on. Now it really sounds telecastery. Is. It's like maybe got like a little bit of the steel thing going on, but that's uh that's pretty much like my settings on this is like the, the tone knob. You can just blend that down, and then of course you know this tone knob, just dialing that back a little bit gets you really really sweet. I put everything on ten for most of my videos because I really want the mids to cut through, uh, and doing that will do so. But maybe like live on gigs, I might roll that back and stuff. Now the other thing that this one has is pretty cool. Now Jay's video. He said uh, he doesn't like push pots, pull pots. I'll say I have two. I don't really use them that much, so there might be something to what he's saying there. But um, that said, I do enjoy having, like, when I need it, and very rarely do I need it. Like, maybe, like, if I'm just playing with some people that have really, really loud amps and, like, nobody's miking anything, we don't have good monitoring, then I might pull my volume knob out that gives me a, uh, a treble boost this puts me like a you know a couple of decibels higher it's not really like a that much of a boost boost um, more just like a frequency boost but I think it really does do a lot to like make my output a little bit more audible and like I said like those emergency situations it's almost like a you know, when when you have a Ferrari, you don't drive it 100 miles per hour, 150 miles an hour, but, like, it's nice to know that you can do it. So it's it's just kind of the same thing, like, just kind of nice to be there. And then I do have this other one. It's called the Fat Switch, which just pushing, pulling, I really, honestly, I don't notice that much of a difference on this guitar. But when I roll it back, just, like, all the way, it really does do it. That's like all the way. Regular works really nice on the middle pickup too. So that's just regular middle pickup, and then here's with the fat switch on. Really kind of nice and punchy. So, um, you know, fun, fun, really cool setup that's just a little bit different from the traditional strat wiring um, that just allows you to really just get kind of like fuller tonal 
capabilities out of this guitar. Um, obviously, as we all know, like you can really just get like a couple of sounds. You get the five, you know, out of the five-way switch. But with this one, it gives you like those extra extra couple, um, and then obviously like the rollback subtlety of things is just really nice. Um, the other option that I love on this guitar is playing all three pickups. So obviously like position two is really sweet. But then I can roll in like the back pickup. So position two would just be these two pickups, middle and, uh, and bridge. But then if, if I roll in the, the back pickup. all three pickups on a lot of the time I'll just leave that like if I'm playing solo guitar I'll just leave all three pickups on myself out but uh, if you like what you hear please do like and subscribe and leave me a comment I have a question for you are there any strap players out there do you have favorite different configurations if so what are they I'd love to check them out um, but anyways yeah I am gonna play my way out and have a great warmth Wednesday and I'll see you tomorrow for theory Thursday and um, check out the website it's down in the description all right I'll see you next time Thank you.